Uh, yeah, I feel like it benefits our defense. Just getting some rest. Uh, some guys got banged up, dinged up uh, in the back half of the season. So I have an opportunity to get healthy, uh, get fresh, and um, just kind of clean up some small things. Uh, we had kind of a – we played on Saturday, played on Sunday, played on Saturday again. So it's been quick turnarounds. I uh, get to go back and watch the tapes so some stuff we can clean up uh, prior games and uh, clean that stuff up uh, heading into playoffs. Yeah, man, uh, I think that's a testament to our vets and our coaches. Uh, they came in since training camp and are trying to push us every single day, uh, find our new leaders. Uh, we got the vet guys, Chris Frank. Uh, Juan's been here a lot, a lot, played a lot of football for us. And Jay Reese coming in uh, from Houston, he's played a lot of football for us. And so we had a good nucleus of guys and we got a lot of young guys who are willing to buy in and um, do their job and do their 111th and uh, communicate um, and also just respect those other guys and come in and work every single day. And um, I, I, I praise those guys that we lost, uh, kind of set the standard of what, what we want to do here. And um, uh, we just had some guys come in and just buy into that. And, uh, Helped us out a lot. Yeah, man. Uh, I was there just a year a year ago, so uh, I know how to be up and down and um, how the training camp goes. And guys get dinged up. I see those guys still competing, uh, push through. Uh, we are, all our rookies. They did that uh, throughout training camp, and it kind of benefited them going into the season, helping them make a back push uh, for these last couple games. Oh, yeah. Like I said, like Patrick mentioned earlier, uh, we kind of want to come in and win the AFC West. Uh, we know how good our division is. Uh, so that's our first one and also getting home field advantage. And uh, it's still in kind of a dicey situation with that one. But uh, again, uh, we kind of our goals, we kind of accomplished those. And um, our next goal is kind of compete for a Super Bowl. Uh, we got a week off and we come back and kind of compete for that as well. Yeah, if I remember correctly, those games we didn't tackle very well, and uh, I didn't really tackle that good today. Um, so just cleaning that, cleaning that up, uh, I feel like those those run out to catch and yards out to catch with playmakers on those two teams especially. Um, those guys can uh, catch the ball and get vertical, uh, get vertical and make plays, and so we just got to tackle to well in the playoffs in order to have a chance. Man. Uh, I guess the biggest thing is just him being him. Uh, he doesn't try to be anybody else. He knows who knows who he is. Uh, he comes in every single day you know, and try to give his best, and that's the only thing we can ask for. Uh, he comes in. Uh, he plays three tech, plays the shade, plays the end, uh, work, plays a pass, uh, hold off double teams. Uh, he keeps the linebackers clean. Uh, that's been a benefit uh, for me for sure, um, and then also for Willie and the other guys, and uh, also the D linemen. Uh, we always know that Tristan will get the slide, so uh, backside usually can get one on ones, and so I help uh, the back uh, backside generate pressure, uh, and that's good for our defense as well. Oh yeah, since I came here, uh, the standards have always been winning. Um, we come in a training camp, we bust our butts off to try to put ourselves in position to win games, um, and ultimately I uh, win the AFC West. And so, uh, Coach Reed and uh, our coaches, Coach Spags, uh, they do a great job pushing us every single day. I try to put ourselves in that position, and um, um, as we stay kept going, uh, it's, it's when the roads get tough, it brings us together. I uh, like, lean on the leaders a lot, um, it, it forces us to kind of grow together. Um, young guys, again, uh, those guys have been ter uh, terrific. Uh, they've been buying into the culture and uh, pushing themselves every single day to get better. And I think that's what it takes to be good in this league. Last one, Nick. Nick, you've seen it in practice, but the scene in the game today with the, I guess, the Arctic Circle, the, the spinning around, pushing the offense, just what was your first reaction when they, when they showed that in, in practice? Yeah, I actually didn't see that in the game today. Uh, so uh, I might not uh, speak correctly on that, but I see them do it in practice. Uh, they kind of do it every every uh, every week. And so I uh, just have fun with it, man. And um, never don't know who's getting the ball. Uh, those guys are playmakers, the dynamic on offense. And Coach Reed does a great job uh, putting guys in position to make plays. Thanks, everybody. Thanks, Nick. Yep, thank you.